All right, our next question, Jim, sent in the corny drive through at gmail.com from Garrett Hernandez. I was rummaging through my old wrestling magazine collection and came across a bit from September 1995 between you, Hunter Hearst Helmsley, and Mantar, oh, in which you hired the future Triple H to teach your beast proper table manners and etiquette. The piece ended with a banana cream pie in your face. Any stories from this shooting and whose idea was it? Oh, God. Yes, I do. And and whose idea it was, I don't know. Old shit stain was around at the magazine at that time. Uh, but we had we didn't have heat at that point. But um, it was a deal where the, the people at the magazine were always trying to figure out something they could take or they could write about or do that would be a, away from wrestling and something humorous and entertaining or whatever the fuck. And they've made it a goddamn, you know, and especially under Russo as big a joke as the TV show was turning into. And because I was with Mantar the one time on television, naturally they, they okay, well, this was like that same fucking, I think I may have been in with Mantar in Pennsylvania because I know this was Wheeling, West Virginia, that we did this. So it was probably the same set of tapings. They said, hey, come over to the goddamn such-and-such such hotel, and we're going to do this photo feature where Hunter Hearst Helmsley, who at that time was just starting out as the, you know, rich snob from Greenwich, is going to try to teach your man Mantar manners. And I'm like, what the fuck? I'm already, I've got to go to the fucking TV and Wheeling to begin with. Um, obviously that's not a surprise, but instead of just going to the building, I got to go around downtown fucking wheeling and find this hotel and go spend an hour or an hour and a half doing this fucking photo shoot. And then when I get there, they want me to end up with the pie in the face. I'm like, what the fuck? I've got my TV clothes here. So I had to go back out in the fucking, as I recall in my rental car and rummage around in my bag and wear some fucking sweated in stuff to get the pie in the face so that I could change and do the, it was just, it was stupid. And it's not like Mantar was happy to be there. He was happy to be anywhere. It wasn't like fucking Helmsley wanted to do it at that point either. But at the same time, he still figured, well, at least I'm in the magazine. Uh, but it just, you know, it just make it up as they go along. Like they were doing, you know, some of those things and take some pictures and then off we go. And then I got lost trying to get to the fucking building because I mentioned downtown Wheeling, West Virginia is fucking ignorant as far as how to get around in that. It all looks the same. Do you think people should include that moment of your face in that cake the same way they include all the other ones in the list of famous cakes that you've had? No, no, no. If I, if just say famous pastries or baked goods, whether it be pies or cakes or whatever. No, that is the sum total of times that I got a pie or cake in the face that it didn't draw money. That one right there. 